Check it out. Just them? Guess so. territory. Come on. I'd rather not bother. It didn't seem very friendly. Agreed. Let's focus on where we can go. This is Junon? Everything above us. Below is under Junon. Little more than an impoverished fishing village. <laughs> Figures. Shinra's always gotta have someone to stop on. It's their friggin' M.O.
One moment. <laughs> Welcome to Under Junon, our sunless oasis. My name is Rhonda. I'm the mayor and sheriff around these parts. for it. <laughs> well, you know what they say. Can't take it with you. Hmm. Hmm. And Aerith to boot, huh? That's another half a million on top. Uh, half a million? <laughs> Down here, though. We know when to turn a blind eye. Consider our lips sealed. Uh, sorry, but I call bullshit. Well, I don't think you would, if you knew even half of what my town's been through. You don't like it? Leave. But, over there, there's a quiet little inn, where everyone's welcome. Any guys in black robes pass through? Not that I saw. Did see some black suits, though. Two guys and a girl. Looked pretty tough. Well, well. They made a beeline right for the elevator. Now we're talking. No, don't even think about it. In case it isn't obvious, upstairs is Shinra turf. And the same goes for the elevator as well. Don't ask me what, but the company's got something big planned up there. And security is tight. You start anything, anything at all, and there will be consequences. Behave yourselves now. black robes around here somewhere, so how are we gonna find them? That would depend on where they are headed. If they mean to continue west, there are only two ways off this continent. By sea, or by air. Right. Might want to ask around town, then. Locals will know routes not on the map. May have even seen stragglers pass through. Or got boats for rent or something. How about we meet at the inn when we're done? Sounds good. And remember, low profile. Hello there. Room for one. Help! Somebody, please! Help! <sighs> Anybody, please! That sword. You're some kind of fighter, aren't you? That was Priscilla. And from the sound of it, she needs a tough guy like you to lend a hand.
cover! Hey! Shinra's most wanted! Get rid of that thing! Say what? Ferret! Focus! Get its attention! On it! Uh! She's breathing. Hey, we need help over here. Somebody, help! Maybe 
someone should go find a doctor? There's no time. God, she's so cold. We need to get her breathing again. Maybe someone should go find a doctor? Don't just stand there, help me! You're on chest compressions. Got it. Now, start! Uh. guys there are from the Splinter Cell. Splinter Cell? They used to be with Avalanche, but left after a policy dispute. <sighs> Easy. They're guests of mine. And this one was trying to save her life. He was? Ugh, nice going, Yuffie. Call the guy a creep, why don't you? You big moron! Dum -dum 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 Okay, Yuffie. Let's get you inside. You've had a rough day. Yeah. All right. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Psst. Not to beat that guy, but kids these days, I swear. Now, now. Who is that? Another one of my guests. I seem to get a lot of them when the world's on fire. Ocean's real quiet today. Too quiet. Something's brewing. Can tell me that much. When an old soul... Hey, you guys are that avalanche splinter cell, right? Now, how the hell did you... I just gotta say, I'm a big, huge fan of yours. HQ wishes they could be as cool as you guys. <sighs> well, uh, we are pretty cool, but... Think we could sit down for a chat later? Got a teensy favor to ask. And gotta thank you for before. Uh, I suppose you could come by the inn tomorrow? Sweet! You won't be sorry. Promise. Later! I know, I know, she laid it on pretty thick. But hey, she's just a kid. What's the harm in hearing her out? Maybe she wants your autograph. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's get ourselves some rooms. Hey, if it isn't the heroes of the hour, I heard about what you did for that girl. Thank you so much. Your stay is on us. We insist. It's the least we can do for you, really. Now then, how many we got? Will four rooms be enough? Uh, could you make it five? Five it is. Oh, everything is comped. So if you need anything at all, just ask. Don't know about you. But I'm dying to put my feet up. That's nice to have the place booked up again for once. Gosh, when was the last time that happened? That's nice to have the place booked up again for once. It was like they were sucking them straight out of my head. And the worst part is that I don't even know what's missing. 
Only that something is... Like it's on the tip of my tongue, but I just can't remember. Damn whispers. Speaking of, have you seen them lately? <laughs> Cloud. Who's in there with you? Oh. Hmm. Red. Thought it was someone else. Nope. I'll clear here, officer. Well, hope the rest of your patrol is just as uneventful. Shinra come calling, I doubt I'll smell them till it's too late. We'll manage. <laughs> it feels like I have fish bones in my nose. My poor nose. I was just about to come find you. Yeah, I... You... Regret what I said in calm. Oh. Come in. I should have never doubted you. It's fine. I never should have doubted you either. Say, do you remember a guy named Emilio? From Nibelheim? The general store kid? Yeah. <sighs> anyway, he left the village right before you did. I thought I'd never see him again. Then one day last year, he shows up at Seventh Heaven. I couldn't believe my eyes. He was all... grown up. Didn't even recognize him at first. Really? Yeah, and what's more, the woman who walked in with him was stunning. Like, she could have been a model, and... <sighs> You're... not interested, are you? Not really, but I I'm happy to listen, so go ahead. It's okay. Forget it. Was this another test? No, it wasn't. I... <sighs> Why deny it? I guess it was, huh? I'm sorry. It's fine. We'll find time to talk. Just the two of us. Figure things out. Just be ready to spill your guts, huh? <laughs> With my iron stomach? <laughs> Night. The gang's all here. It's time you got to know me. 
My name is Yuffie, Materia Hunter and Elite Ninja Operative for the interim Wutai government. I left my beloved homeland behind to bring an end to Shinra's reign of terror and prove that Wutai is not to be trifled with! Mm. Uh, Wutai? Yep. Which brings me to that little favor I mentioned yesterday. Long story short, I want you to join me. HQ, they just didn't understand. But you guys get it. <sighs> Don't ninjas creep around in the dark slitting people's throats. I mean, we've done some shit, but we ain't about to stoop that way. I resent that. <laughs> Although, that is something we do. alone so far from home is expensive. So I've been moving from town to town, hustling, scraping together enough scratch to keep sticking it to the man. Until, that is, I came here. And lucky I did, because I met Rhonda. She offered me the gig of a lifetime, an assassination. And guess who the target is? Seriously, guess! <sighs> Just spit it out already. Who else but a certain company's new president, Rufus freaking Shinra! That crazy or what? And that douchebag will be here any minute now. Up there here anyway. Enjoying his fancy inauguration parade. These people had their country stolen from them, and then their sunlight. Junon demands revenge. So when the president steps out, Oh, wow. Tell us more. Mm. Okay. You want to know how Rhonda's planning on paying me? With your bounty suckers. What? Wow, gotta hand it to her. The lady works fast. Well, this was fun. See ya. Hey! <laughs> If you manage to get away, you should try to find Priscilla. She'll get you topside. <laughs> now, now! You don't want to make me come in there and fetch you, because I would love to do it! Who's that? <sighs> A pain in the ass. Let's go. How long do you intend to keep me waiting? Absence certainly makes the heart grow fonder, my friend. <laughs> Still playing hard to get, eh? Well, I've got news for you, young man. As if by fate, the Speed Demon has been entrusted with a singular task. Retrieving one Aerith game. Uh, me? You come alone? <laughs> it only takes two to tango. Besides, you and I like to go big, and a venue this small just won't do. But no need to worry. I found the perfect stage. The city above, where we can dance up a storm. Seek me out, and we'll put our last performance to shame with a show none shall ever forget. <laughs> you got some weird friends, man. We might want to think about getting out of here. These people don't need more trouble. Yuffie said to talk to Priscilla if we wanted to get topside, right? Let's go find her. Thanks for dealing with that Shinra nut job. Don't you think for even a second we did that for you? The slime ball who sold us out. Take it. Not much, but it's yours. The hell's this supposed to be? <laughs> Your bounty. 
part of it anyway. You thought I'd put you through the ringer like that without making it worth your while? We're on the same side. Always have been. And what if Biker Boy had taken us in? Then I would have had to improvise. But I didn't, because it all worked out. Worked out fine. Like I pray it will for Yuffie upstairs.